Um, my name's called Karen Smith and I'm 12 years old. So I'm sitting there doing my work, like I'm, I, I'm not focused, I'm mostly focused about what's going on, what's going to happen later. And students normally end up here at Riverside Meadows by being um, identified at a primary school level for having extra needs and each child here has an uh, EHCP, which is an educational healthcare plan. So we often see uh, when we go into schools, the kids that we are engaging with really, really listen to what we've got to say as soon as we walk in with the Cambridge United badge on our, on our shirt. And they feel connected to a community instantly. And they're quite motivated to take part and they've got lots of positive role models within the, the players and the manager. So that way they're instantly kind of listening to what you've got to say. It helps massively to have external people come in. I mean, for the kids here, it can sometimes get a boring hearing the same things over and over again from, from the uh, staff members here. So just to have another professional come in and have the same values that and we have just cements the process that we're trying to do with most of the kids here. I mean, Thursday is always a best day for um, a lot of them. As soon as, soon as they know they're coming in, um, as soon as they get here, they're ready in their uh, PE kit, ready to go. Uh, most of the time, it's the best day of the week for, for most of the learners that love sport here. In the morning, I get so excited that I want to do football in the morning. When I'm out there, I'm running about, having my ha ha happy smile on my face, and then at the end, we shake hands, and yeah, it's done. I feel like so much happier when I'm outside, not, on the in not inside. When I get outside, I'm more happy, and I really want to do stuff. So from my perspective, we want to give all students the opportunity to have um, football sessions and mental health interventions and learn about our planet and different things like that. But particularly those in alternative provision, um, they've often had a really difficult time in schools up until the point that they reach a really good school like this. So just to show them again that they can be part of a team, show that they can engage in discussions with their peers and learn from each other. Um, that's why I think it's really important for alternative provisions to have this kind of intervention as well as mainstream schools. A lot of our students struggle to be in a uh, positive team uh, environment. Since they've come in they have really, really helped not just Kieran but a lot of our learners with um, working, working in a team and uh, positively work, working in that team as well, so yeah, definitely. In my old school I never used to go, I never did all this, but but now this year I'm building up my confidence until now I'm in a better life basically so I get to do all of this and yeah.